Hi guys! Good morning! Welcome back to my channel! My name is Jonah and once again, I'm here dahil uh, today is a uh, registration day of my temporary permit of residency here in Russia. So I just wanted to share it with you. So that's why I am here once again. Alright, alright, alright. Today is Tuesday, July uh, 23, 2019. Tapos yung uh, appointment namin sa registry ay 5.15. So right now, my husband is already in the village. By the way guys, we went to Moscow from yesterday to take his sister. Uh, dahil nga dun sa sabi ko na ano, sa registration ko, I need his sister's signature also. As the owner of the house, on my address, Provide, provided on my visa. Ganito kasi yan, ipapaliwanag ko yan ha. Para, para hindi kayo medyo malito. So, ipapaliwanag ko muna ng konting-konti. Kasi napakunti na lang din ang time ko guys. My husband texted me, 4.30, be ready to go out with Bova. So, with little Putin. By the way, I've, I've already done, also to little Putin, I've done on everything. So, I had no problem anymore. So, all I need to do is to explain on you right now, why do I need his sister? So, ganito yun. Sa, katulad sa visa, Pag nag apply ka, di ba ang hinihingi ng main requirements ay yung photocopy ng passport ng sponsor mo together with his personal data and his address. Ang reason kasi da, guys, kaya hinihingi yon ng immigration kasi nga, uh, imbitado ka ng sponsor mo. Kaya kailangan nila ng data dun sa, dun sa sponsor mo, uh, dun sa personal data ng sponsor mo at especially dun sa address ng sponsor mo. Kasi like for example, you commit a crime here in Russia so, so they can locate you where are you staying here in Russia like that. So, it needs also on your registration if you have a residency right here. So, since uh, in my visa, although we're, although we're living here in Russia um, separately from his parents, but I made my entry here in Russia with my private visa which provided of uh, his parents' address. And this parents' address, the house of his parents is owned of his sister. Why pa naman yung parents niya? Kumpleto pa naman. Pero yung titulo, ay nakapangal yung titulo ng bahay, nakapangalan na doon sa sister niya. Kaya sa ngayon, the ownership of their house is long to his sister. Kaya ganon. And uh, the same nga sa visa. Every time na mag apply ka ng visa, tapos it, it got granted. And then you got your entry here in Russia. Like for example, you are already here inside. I think one week from the day you, you entry here in Russia, you have this one week to register yourself to the registry. Para nga malaman, matrack ka ng government nila kung saan ka nag stay as migrant. Ganun yun, katulad din sa residency. I hope na intindihan nyo guys kasi medyo ako rin nalilito <laughs> sa paliwanag ko. Kasi yung isip ko nga nagmamadali. <laughs> so yun. So yun nga guys, by the way, yung nagbigay sa amin ng appointment this 5.15, ay makukuha nyo tong appointment na to guys from immigration din galing dun sa releasing uh, <laughs> sa releasing mo. So like for example, I... Uh, I got my releasing from Friday at yung sa mga hindi nakapanood doon sa releasing ko at doon sa passport reporting ko, I will put a link below in my description <laughs> or also watch out this video till the end and I will put a end screen at the end of this video little put it is right there on my back he's always like that don't close it then uh-huh nah, nah. so so back to my registration guys, I hope that uh, I could make a scoop right now. I just hope because we will be with little Putin guys and to, and also his sister. I am quite shy to Anya because uh, hmm, she's a very quiet person. <laughs> so ayan guys, nahirapan ako ngayon bumangon kasi nag-edit ako ng video, ng isang video from last night because I thought, my, because my, my husband told me that uh, um, my registration form is like uh, registration of vi vi my visa before. Every time that we, we renew my visa, we got this uh, form also from... from
So back to what I've said, guys. Hello, <laughs> Putin is here with me. Papano niya? Makulit. Super active niya. And by the way, yesterday we went only not uh, to pick up her sister, but also to meet uh, Tulia's cousin, um, Natasha. Shout out to Natasha if she is uh, watching this video. And to her family, especially to her mama, Auntie Tamara, shout out to you. So my husband, guys, is already here. Da. Da. Bob. Bob. Papa's DS. Mm -hmm. My husband is already here, guys. Hey. Anya's in the car. I will just turn off the computer. I just turned off the computer. Do, 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 do. Oh. In the room. I just turned off the light from outside, but not in the room. Documents, pa? I sleep at 8. Huh? I sleep at 8. But why? I eat it one minute last night. Because you told me that it's possible that it's possible for you to why go to my fault. It wasn't your fault. I never said that it was your fault. Sorry, no. Oi. <laughs> he was angry because because I sleep until on a very late time, until in the afternoon. So okay. <laughs> This one. I made it from Friday. It was Friday time. I made it, I made it, I made it broken. And I forgot I forgot to stitch it. So we're here guys. I'm with Anya. <laughs> By the way, my husband went to immigration to ask if it's possible for him to go to registry and to register my my permit alone. But I think the answer is no, so that's why we end up right here now. Oh, please, are you shot? My God, what happened? Hello, what happened to you? She stopped for a while, guys. Two years best friend got a car, car accident. And that police is also right here now. Yeah, it's just very little. Ah, someone bumped him. I thought it was him who bumped someone. Uh -huh. Ooh. And where are the boys? Pa? In the garden? No, in the, in the car. Mm -hmm. So guys, we are here kami. I will give you an update later. See you.
भगवान Maybe this registry is here, also together in this building of immigration. Maybe just different room because we're here again. So here we are, guys. It was just like that. My husband just dropped us right here at home. Ninada, put it back to room. Ah, we just came. It was really... It was really hassle when we've been there. Because today, I don't know, but... There are lots of people right there. We did not went into fall in line because we have this number and also this... Uh, woman who accommodate us in the reception. They already know us, so we never fall in line. We just wait for for her call. May I ako na ipapaliwana, guys, ha? I will just uh, turn on computer first so that little Putin will sit here. Only in the bed, by the way. He's here with us. It was very, very hard to us because, first of all, we have little Putin with us. And uh, little Putin can't just settle down inside of the building, which he is just on uh, his papa's arms. It's very hard on it. Because he's just very active, really. Like, you can't even handle it. Even his papa, he can't handle it. Ay, ay, ay. Oh. I do not have these documents with me. I got only, I got only little Putin stuffs and the documents is on... It's on Tulia's bag, so I can't I can't explain it together with documents then. Even my passport is with him, so I can't show you these these stamps and everything. So here we are guys, I'm here now. Papaliwanag ko na kung ano nangyari, ha? Since Lil Putin was cranky on his papa's arms, we were there already. We already made this talon together with Anya. So since we have this talon, all we need to do is to wait. Uh, when uh, their reception will be available and they will call us and so while waiting Lil Putin was very cranky because he just want to he just want to because Lil Putin wants to come down and wants to run and to be freed but we can't do it to him like that because uh, it was it was very busy right there and it has a lot of people and I don't know why today has a lot of people right there Maybe it was a kind of open for everyone, that's why. So Julia decided to go outside and it was only me and Anya right there. Which which we don't know, we don't know how to do how to do it and what will we do? And Tolia and even Tolia took also the talon. We really don't know. We really don't have an idea how to do it with ourselves. So when we are already there inside, when that woman called us, when we are already there. Um at first, it was smooth and okay, but it, it has only a little bit problem when this woman uh, find the original copy because uh, Julia made a photocopy on everything, on every document, registration, and also this paper from immigration with their logo. Tulia also photocopy on it, and uh, but the woman said that no, she will not take the photocopy, but only original. So guys, if you are also a foreign wife like me, eh, and uh, you're also processing a documents like this. Tips for you. You must pass every documents you have, which is original, not a photocopy. So that you will have no problem. A little Putin wants my seat. No, it is Suda. It is Suda. I gave him a remote control to play. He likes it. <laughs> So back to what I am saying, 
ang unang ginawa nung taga-immigration ay uh, kinuha yung passport ng sister ng asawa ko, tapos yung passport ko, at tapos yung passport din ni Tulia. Kinu- kinulikta niya yun, tapos in-inspect. Pagkatapos ng inspection dun sa mga passport namin, ay ikinumpara niya yung information dun sa passport ng kapatid ng asawa ko, tapos dun sa, dun sa application form ko for registration. Pagkatapos nun, nung exact naman lahat ng nakasulat dun sa information na nasa passport ng kapatid ng asawa ko, since it was exact, Wala nang chichi burichi, but, uh, binigyan kami ng tatlong papel, uh, nilagyan ng date for today, tapos uh, pinapirma yung buong pangalan at signature ng patid ng asawa ko as owner. Guys, again, the reason why we need uh, Tulia's sister is because she is the owner of the house. Ha? So if you are going also to make this document, you will also need the owner of the house which the address you've provided on your information. So balik tayo doon sa tatlong papel na sinabi ko. Yun ng tat- tatlong papel na yun. Uh, first, Anya filled up her name and signature. And uh, sa baba, ako naman yung nag-filled up my name and signature as well. Pagkatapos nun, ay hinanap nga ng babae yung original paper na may logo nga ng immigration. Tapos yun na, done na. Tinatakan na lang nila yung passport ko. Yun nga lang, hindi ko ma- maipakita sa inyo ngayon yung passport ko. Kasi nga, nandoon yung passport ko sa bag ng asawa ko. Nakalimutan kong kunin yung mga dokumen sana para, sana para maisama ko sa vlog ko ngayon. So ayun, pagkatapos sa taka ng passport ko, binigay sa amin yung dalawang kopya doon sa tatlong papel na yun. Kinuha ng immigration yung isa, yung dalawang kopya ay binigay sa amin. At yun na, tapos na, yun lang, ganun lang, ganun lang kadali. Mga siguro we stay there for about less than 10 minutes and we're already done. Basta kompleto lang talaga lahat ng papel nyo guys, napakadali lang na iasikasuhin yung papers. So ganun lang siya guys. And by the way guys, for doing this registration, you must also to do this on immigration office, not to the local registry office which you do usually went on the registration of your visa. No guys, definitely no. For registration of this uh, residency permit, you must go also to register yourself in immigration. Again, in immigration guys. So I think I've already made it clear right here. <laughs> so I hope you got an idea on how the processing of this kind of uh, uh, documents right here in Russia, especially to those uh, someone which is also a foreigner wife right here in Russia. I hope you really got an idea, guys. Because I was there in that state also being clueless. Like you always wonder that, uh, oh, ano kaya yung mangyayari sa mga susunod? Ano kaya yung gagawin mo doon? Ano kaya yung gagawin nila? Yung parang tipong ganun. Ganyan din yung mga iniisip ko. Kaya, I hope guys, if you are also a foreigner wife like me right here in Russia, it will give you an idea. How will it be if it will be already on your situation? So, thank you very much guys for watching. I think that's all. So, kung may mga karagdagan pa kayong tanong, I comment below. Or also, you can follow me in Instagram right here. And feel free to ask me there also guys. But before you log it out guys, don't forget to subscribe down below so you will be updated to all of my upcoming videos. And so, Give also a thumbs up this video if it helps you or you will like it. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.